Sharon from Cook, and I don't know if that is Cook County or the Cook Islands or where, but this is a great question. Actually, it has to do with uploading government forms of ID, a copy of a government form of ID or pay stubs or bank accounts or tax returns with so many people doing different gig work and having less traditional employees where it's a straightforward employer paycheck scenario. It really helps landlords to be able to confirm that this is the person and then also see, okay, well, I see that on this contract, they made X number of dollars and on this one, you know, why? So that you can verify their income or that they have income in the bank. So the answer to the question is our preferred way of doing that. And you'll hear me coming back to this is to use a proper management software tool of some kind, and I'll get more into that, but many of them now will allow you, and even as a matter of course, to upload ID and any documents, you can request documents. And the other benefit is that those documents then get kept in the cloud and the tenants can get to them too. And another thing that goes kind of alongside of this is that you can also require that tenants uh, have renter's insurance and provide proof of renter's insurance and that be uploaded as well. So a lot of these are our partners or when you're on our site or here, we will mention companies, uh, many of whom we will get a, a small commission from if you go to purchase a product. Uh, we try to, to evaluate many of them. So you have lots of options, but just, just full dis disclosure, but you know, Avail and TurboTenant and RentReady, uh, many of these really robust uh, property management software uh, do offer the, this upload.